MC and welcome back to my Nissan 350Z Roadster. I don't feel like I should be calling it a Roadster because the roof still doesn't work. Now, in my last video of this car, I showed you my new sports cats, which made it tremendously loud. And I said, if the video gets to 2000 likes, which I thought was a pretty good benchmark, that I would do a tunnel run in the 350Z. So in 48 hours, you smashed it. It got 3000 likes. So here I am near the Hindhead Tunnel. I've got the Devil's Punch Bowl behind me. It's a great area, a great tunnel, and hopefully some great sound. Now, since I made that video, I have been driving this car a little bit around the neighborhood and my driving style has indeed changed as also I mentioned in the video so I'm driving a bit more sedately especially through towns and villages because it's a bit much and when people see a car like this they don't smile they moan and groan I think if I did get the roof to work it would look a bit more like a sports car and people will be happier to see and hear it talking of the roof it's probably the fifth bone motor I'm looking for a garage to take out the motor and fix it themselves I don't want to be taking out the motor myself because it's not something that I want to do so I'm looking for someone to give the car to chuck them the keys and let them do the work and I haven't found anyone yet so I've shopped around on some roof specialists but most people don't like touching these so if you know of any roof specialists someone must have done it it's common on these cars these roofs just break today as you might have also noticed is fantastic weather I am in the t-shirt for the first time of the year for like six months I'm in my send it t-shirt I've also got a quick word from this video sponsor Cloudburst who have given me the car's locked. Their new odor eliminator. So there's a range of great scents to try. They're all long lasting and check this out for its high pressure. Aim the nozzle and so link in the description below and use Adam 10 to get 10% off your order. So the plan is to find some tunnels and make some sounds. Oh, it's a lovely day. I can put my windows down, just not the roof. Because I've been driving sedately, I don't often do that, so it's... It's a pleasure, to say the least. So I should calm down a bit now. Hindhead Tunnel is kind of the other direction. I need to do a loop-de-loop -loop and go find it. I think there's an Aston Martin just around the corner. Let's do a bit of car spotting. Just on the left there, there it is by the retro petrol pumps. Add some of that. Now another thing, um, due to the cats being sports cats a bit cheaper, they're not really cleaning the air as much as Nissan think they should. So my engine warning light is on. So the car needs to go to a remapper and get remapped so they can teach the car what emissions it should be reading. Um, apparently one of the heater elements has gone through, so I need a new heater element. So, still got a bit of work to do to it. Just need to find a place to remap it. So, any suggestions? I'd be greatly appreciative. It's ripped so high. That's 70. That's all we can do. Okay, so the tunnel will be coming up soonish. I actually reckon this car at higher RPM is louder than my Cobra. And I guess we can find out now because we are 580 yards away from the mouth of the tunnel. So we are going to drop down a few. Uh, let's whack into the third. We could try second. Here we go. Oh, I've got it underneath my foot. I'm excited. Or hated it. I can't work out 
the expression, but he stuck with it. Well, we're going to go back and do one more because we can and we should and we are. Okay. try and sing happy birthday with my exhaust but I would love to do that um, so I should probably look on the Hindhead local forums and see if anyone complains about a trombone being blown through Hindhead tunnel uh, <laughs> so yeah sorry about that okay one final hurrah then we're gonna find some smaller tunnels and see if we can make me, me deaf I don't know there we go there we go I did tell myself to behave through villages, but... Echoes are just so easily done. Sorry, mate. Okay, we're just approaching a tunnel under the road we were just on, and luckily there are no locals anywhere near here, other than maybe some cows. Make some noises. <laughs> yes, that's good. I've been waiting for that. Thank you. I'll take that. What is that? These are my neons. Oh. It's the wire for my neons. Uh, it was hanging off earlier, and I was like, I'm gonna have to rip that off. I reversed over it instead. We're now reversing into the tunnel after having ran over my neons. <laughs> Did you hear the crackles? It crackles! Oh, it pops! Are they flames? That's new! <laughs> so there you have it! my car through some tunnels as promised so um i'm gonna have to change my ears later swap them out for a new pair because i've gone a little bit deaf um thanks to my vq my v6 my z my 350z the nissan the um the the, the ford street car so remember this is my daily driver so i'm putting up with this every single day um so i am kind of changing my driving style when i go through towns and residential areas but through tunnels i might keep that as a bit of a novelty um, um, so yes, yeah, so let me know, please do, if you know a garage that can fix my roof for me. I'm going to do some scousing around the internet, see what I can do, see if I can get it sorted for the summer, because that'll be amazing, and I can deafen even more people with the roof down. So, I hope you enjoyed that video. Follow me on Instagram for all the updates and highlights about the meets that I do, and the things that I do to my cars, and let me know in the comments what you want to see next. But for now, thanks for watching.